I hear all this talk about love undaunted. Well, I'm here to tell you a story about how this love was not only undaunted, but it was flaunted in front of everybody. It was written down by a man named Paul Lawrence Dunbar. And it's called How Lucy Backslid. The times is mighty stern amongst the people up our way while they disputing and they's arguing and they's fussing night and day. And all this monstrous trouble that it make me tired to tell is about that Lucy Jackson who was such a mighty belle. Yeah, she was the preacher's favorite. And he told the church one night how she traveled through a cloud of sin, a bearing of a light. But now I allow he thinking that she must have lost her lamp because Lucy done backslid and there's trouble in the camp. Her daddy wants to beat her, but her mama dares him too because she's looking at the question from a woman's point of view. And she say that now she wouldn't have it any different if she could. And that her daughter, her daughter only acted just like any other would. Of course, you know, when women's argue, they is mighty easily led by their hearts and don't go fooling about the reasons of the head. So her mama laid the law down. She ain't recognize it wrong. Because you got to make allowance for the cause that go along. You see, the cause that make Miss Lucy for to throw her grace away our fears won't bear no inspection when it comes to Judgment Day because hmm, though the same thing been working ever since the world began, a woman disobeying for to entice along a man. Mm -hmm. So if you attended the revival that we held the winter pass, you can recollect that Congress was coming thick and fast. But they ain't no use in talking. They was all left in the lurch when old Miss Jackson's daughter found her peace and took the church. Why she shouted over every inch of Ebenezer's flow from up in the preacher's pulpit from their town to the door. And she hugged and squeezed her mama and she hugged and kissed her dad. And she struck out at her sister, people say, like she was mad. <laughs> well, I attended some revivals that was lively in my day. And I see folks get religion in most every kind of way. But I tell you, and I speak in true indeed, that that gal took her religion harder than the hardest yet I ever seen. Well, from that was, Sister Jackson, won't you please do this or that? And she must always start the singing when they pass around the hat. And there wasn't nothing in that church you could go by without Sister Lucy Jackson didn't have her finger in the pie. <laughs> well, the saying's awful truthful that it's easier to sail when that sea is calm and gentle than the weather out of gale. Hmm. And that's what caused this woman trouble. And if the storm had kept away, she'd have had enough religion for to last out her day. You see, Lucy, she went with Lysa Davis. Mm -hmm. We call him Ike. But when she joined church, you know there was lots of little places that of course she couldn't go. And she had to give up her dancing, her singing, and her play. Honey, it's natural that such goings on is gonna drive a man away. So when Lucy got so solemn, Ike, he started for the go with a gal who was a sinner and could make a better show. Oh, Lucy, she just went on the meeting like she didn't care a rap. But my suspicions had me taken there was something going to drop. Because a gal don't let religion or no other sort of thing stop her when she take a notion that she want that wedding ring. Oh, you can promise her the blessing of a happy after life. <laughs> and it's nice to be an angel but she'd rather be a wife. So when Christmas come and that old scoundrel give a little frolic on the lawn, didn't surprise me not the little little seeing Lucy looking on. But then I see the way the lightning going shining from her eye, just as Ike and his new gal went a gallivanting by. Isn't that tiddling? 
she giggling. She give her dress a flirt like the people she was passing was as common as the dirt. And the minute she was dancing, oh, that gal put on more ass than a cat of taking kittens up a pair of winding stairs. <laughs> oh, well, she could afford to show her smartness because she couldn't help but know that with just the present dancers, yeah, she, she was on another flow. But she kind of cooled down, I reckon, when she happened on the sly for to notice that dead lightning that I seed in Lucy's eye. And she couldn't been so astonished when the people give a shout and Lucy throw her mantle back and come a gliding out. Oh, some arm was there to take her as she fluttered down the flow like a feather from a bed tick when the wind commenced to blow. Soon as Tilly see the trouble, she just turned and tossed her head. Seemed like she lost all her spirit and all her daringness was dead. <laughs> She didn't cut another caper near a time the blessed night. And the other ones, they couldn't get enough delight. You see, when you keep a coat a standing in the stable all along, when it do get out, it's natural it be pulling strong. And if you tie up your feelings, here's the best advice to take. You look out for an awful loosening when the string that hold them break. Lucy's mama groaned to see her. And her pappy stormed in tow. But she kept right on a holding to the center of the flow. <laughs> and then they went and they ran and asked the pastor if he couldn't make her quit. But to tell another story, throw that preacher in a fit. Tilly Taylor chewed her hanker till she chewed it in a hole. <laughs> All the sinners was rejoicing because a lamb had left the fold. And the last I seen of Lucy... She and Ike were side by side. Hmm. I don't blame that gal for dancing, and I couldn't if I tried. Cause for the men that wants to marry, they ain't growing round on trees. And the gal that wants to get one surely has to try to please. Oh, it's a hard thing for a woman just to pray and just sit down. And to sacrifice her husband so to try to gain a crown. Hmm. Well, I don't say she was justified in following her plan, but though she lost her legend, yes, she surely got the man. Well, later on, when she is certain that the preacher makes them fast, she can just go back to church and ask forgiveness for the past.